My name's Nick Strawn. I'm one of the members of the design team from Athfield Architects and we're here today at the site of the proposed Johnsonville Library and Community Hub and we'll be just spending a little bit of time today talking you through some of our first ideas and thoughts and concepts about what this building may be. So firstly a little bit about the history of the site itself. The the position of the library building here occupies a high point between the two harbours of Porirua and Wellington and historically was a point of movement between those two harbours. Now that is both in pre-European times and in more recent times. The site is near the centre of what was known as Johnson's Clearing, an area that was heavily forested in native timber that was logged and exported sent overseas. The initial thinking that we have done about the site has been about it being a clearing in close proximity to a crossroads, a place of movement but also a place of pause. In our first thoughts about the Johnsonville Library design, we've been conscious of, of the nodes of existing activity that we have around the site where we are today. And these really run all the way from Johnsonville Road through towards the centre of the mall and then over to Moorfield Road to where the site of the proposed library would be. And around the edges of this are the current community activities which range from the Johnsonville Community Centre to the Keith Spry Pool to Memorial Park. And the library should start to have a connection function and that's from the park past the current community facilities through towards the mall and all the way through to Johnsonville Road and what is the main street. Some of the first thoughts that we've been putting together about the design of the library have revolved around the existing topography of the site itself and how we can create a great, active, vibrant space and an excellent library learning landscape. There is a roadside and there is also a park side to the library development itself. This means on the road side we have quite an active, busy edge and that that should really be complemented by a more relaxed park type environment on the passive edge. And the key design move here is the introduction of a link over two levels working with the existing topography connecting through from this space down over towards Moorfield Road. These are some of the first thoughts that the design team has had about the proposed Johnsonville Library and we will soon be moving into concept design phase. We are really looking forward to receiving some of your feedback to ensure that together we can create a great community facility. Mm -hmm.